another glorious day at Carver Box Church. Yes, praise the Lord Jesus. Amen. Beautiful day in West Palm Beach, Beach, Florida. This is the courthouse, and this is the real courthouse, though. <laughs> Praise the Lord, with Jesus as our advocate, and we are ready to refresh this, the people. This is the courthouse in the natural, yes. and this is the heavenly courthouse. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> Hallelujah. Nice to meet you. You said you had pain in your back for how long? I've been having it for like a month now. A month? Yes. Okay, so... How'd you get that pain? Because of the car accident. Ah, car accident. Yes. So it was it was very traumatic? Yes. Traumatic. I have trouble saying that word. Tra is it traumatic or... Traumatic. It's not... Yeah, yeah. It's my northeast. I'm from New Jersey. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm just going to touch your back. Okay. Okay? So Father in heaven, I lift up crystal to you. And I release the word of God that says, by his stripes, you have been healed. Every bit of pain. Leave her right now. Get off her right now. Bones come into order. All trauma leave. All fear leave. And I speak his peace upon you. A, a peace that surpasses all understanding. Jesus name. Come into order right now. Amen. 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 How are you feeling? Good. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, how is the pain level? Is there any pain left? Not that much, but it's like, it's move, still there. But move that, around a little, Chris. So tell me when you move, does it feel better? Yes. It feels better than... It feels better, but not completely gone? Yeah, it's not completely gone, okay, but it's... Oh, hold on. One more time. Uh, uh, it's deal with like, you know, it, there's a controlling, like people that, like you're very gentle humble person oh, yes, and right. people that try to control you you know and so like jesus came to set people free right and so like there's fear and doubt and all and you know the devil is trying to attack you with stuff like that yeah. right yes. and so you know so like but like you're much stronger than you realize the devil tries to make you feel like you're not as strong as you are yes. Yes. but you're much stronger than you are than he thinks you are or you're much stronger than he's trying to make you feel like you are you're even prophesying that you're blessed. Yes. Right? Yes. And so, like, it's really, like, in, it's like in the lower back pain. Oh, okay. So the lower back pain is, like, it, it's like people can get lower back pain from, like, uh, worry, money worries and stuff. Is, is there any money worries? No. You feel good on that? Yeah. Okay. So, so right now, all the rest of that pain, we her back right now in Jesus name you belong to Jesus you are blessed just like you're prophesying yes. so life and strength to your back and r right leg like any short muscle like if your leg is short like right leg be lengthened right now tight muscles in the right leg tight muscles in the right tight muscle I can't speak today <laughs> tight muscles in the right leg and lower back be loosened and right leg grow in Jesus name Right leg come out, tight muscles be loosened. You, you feel any stretching in your right leg? Not really. You feel, no, no, pay, pay attention to your right leg and the muscles in your back, all right? So, okay. so tight muscles in the right back, the lower right back and hip and leg be loosened and right leg grow in Jesus' name. All pain leaves the lower back in Jesus' name. You feel any stretching now in your right leg? Yeah, but like my back is not hurting like it was. It went away. Yes. And the pain was on the lower right yes, side? it was on my lower back. And you didn't, it was on the lower right side. Yes. You didn't tell me that. No. I just started speaking to the muscles in your lower right hand side. Yeah. And, and uh, so that's, so like it was like, so a tightness came on here. And, and when there's a tightness in the muscles, the leg pulls up. Yes. And it makes one leg shorter than the other. Mm -hmm. So, so like, did you, you felt some stretching also? Yes, but it's like, with my back, it used to hurt really bad. Yeah. But like now it's like not even hurting. You don't feel anything. Yeah, no. walk up, take a few yeah, steps. Cause I should say, Jesus, I believe. Jesus, I believe. You are my <laughs> healer. You are my healer. Feels good, right? Yes. You, you feel more level? Yes, yeah, than the, how I felt before. Right, the yes. devil tries to knock you out of balance, out of, <laughs> out of whack, out of balance. But Jesus, it says he makes the crooked way straight. Mm -hmm. Right, and, and so like, but so the devil is afraid of you he tries to like make you feel like you're not good enough or not smart enough or you don't have what it takes but you have more than enough you have far more than any unredeemed person around here 
and there's plenty of unredeemed people, mm -hmm. right? You are far greater than every one of those unredeemed persons. I don't care what position they have in the courthouse, if they're unredeemed, you are far greater than they are. Because the Bible says, greater is he who is in you than he who is in the world. Amen. And these people have a temporary authority, but you have an eternal authority in Jesus. Amen? Amen. Praise Amen. the Lord. High five, sis. <laughs> <laughs> Praise the Lord. Is there something else you've been praying for? There's something else you've been asking the Lord, right? Yes. Yes. So I want to come in agreement because the word of God says that two or more ask for anything in his name and agree, it will be given. So what is it you've been asking for? The God for my mom because she has cancer. Oh. And your mom's name? It's Katina. Katina. Yes. Father in heaven. And let's teach her, Katina. yeah, let's teach her authority to speak that herself, too. Yeah, yes, yes. So you, you can say this because you've got a resurrection power in you, right? You yeah. have it all in you. The kingdom of God is in you. So you're going to say, cancer, get off my mother. Cancer, get off my mother. Get all the way out of her. Get all the way out of her. I curse you. I curse you. All cancer go. All cancer go. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. And I speak life over my mother. And I speak life over my mother. And I speak full restoration. And I speak full restoration. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Jesus, give, give Byron your peace. Let him peace experience story. your peace right now. Supernatural peace, Jesus. You said... My peace I give to you, my peace I leave with you. I do not give as the world gives. So do not let your hearts be troubled and do not be afraid. So confirm that word right now, Holy Spirit, in the name of Jesus Christ. Your peace on Byron. Supernatural peace, Lord, so he knows you're real and that he knows that you're on his side and that Satan is a loser and that you're going to give him that wisdom also to deal with all spiritual situations. So peace, peace, peace. Be at rest. So, like, are you experiencing negative? Yes, sir. What is it like? I, when, I, when I walked out the court, when I had a conversation with you, I felt peace the time you opened your mouth. Just a few minutes ago? Yeah. Yeah, because I've experienced it. I know. You can't give away anything you don't have. You yeah. can only give away what you have. So, like, I have the peace of Jesus Christ in me. Even though I have a similar past as you, I used to fight all the time. It's like, it's like in, in the old me, the flesh, there's, there's a corruption in the flesh that you're not getting rid of. You've got to keep, like Jesus put the old man to death. You've got to keep it dead and live in the spirit at all times. And But that old man wants attention. you got to say, shut up, get out of here. You're not running things. I'm, I'm listening to the spirit of the living God. That's Amen. what's going to And so I have that. I get the word of God in me. I maintain that peace in my life. Yeah, it happened. Let me give you the back story. Okay. So, in, I used to play high school basketball. And when I, we were playing and we were doing suicides, you know, running from one end of the court to the other end of the court, as quick as we can toward the line, so we can build our endurance and stamina, things like that. And the coach had two of us running. And one time I was running with my eyes closed, and one guy was running with his head down, and his head hit my teeth in the bottom of it, and it just moved my jaw out of the place. Right. And since then, since then, I've always had this. And how issue. long ago was that? This was like I want to say um, 1999, 2000. So it's like 20 years ago. 20 years ago. Okay. So I want to pray for you right now. Oh, well, there's more. Okay. There's more. And then I'm in a <laughs> <So, as> <laughs> okay, game show. <laughs> wait, there's more. There's more. No, but wait, there's more. Uh, and then uh, lately, I've been having this issue where. I've been, been told that when I sleep, I'm having trouble breathing or stop breathing. I sleep apnea, yeah. and, I, and it's, I guess my snoring is getting bad. And, and my, it had the same issue with my brother, my younger brother. Right. And he went and got operation, he operated on, and he uh, removed his tonsils and his anus. And after that, he became better. But I, I don't want to go. Right, it's God put the tonsils in you. Right. I don't want to go under the knife. Right. I'm afraid yeah. because you know I don't believe in removing anything that God put there. Yeah. So God, there's if a God reason. wants to remove it, he can. There's a reason it's there. Exactly. There's a right. the reason it's there. So that, I've been having issues with that. We're um, going to pray for supernatural weight loss. That's right. Because that'll be connected to it. That's right. I'm so happy you said that because I've been having yeah. issues with the weight. And I've been having stomach issues for years. Yeah. Years. So we're going to deal with that. So, like, is yeah, there anything? Are you too, too much mm. sugar eating? You know, or no, the thing is, you know, I'm not even eating a lot. Right. That's the thing. Okay, so it's demonic. 
there's an unclean. You know, you can. Any when Christians don't understand or believe that they can be a Christian and have a demon attacking them, they just don't. They're that's what the demons want. They're you're. A, I can tell you're a believer. So what they do is they operate in the realm of the flesh. They're touching you in, in the flesh. You know, the Bible says flesh and blood cannot enter the you know cannot inherit the kingdom of heaven, right? So it's like that's where they, they that's very superficial. They operate in a superficial realm, and they're not touching your spirit, man. It's like you're, you're we're, we're waiting on the redemption of our bodies, right? That's what we're waiting on, the redemption of our bodies. And so we're subject to the weaknesses in in the enemy in this realm. So that's why de demons can attack Christians. Right, so I, I felt that I felt there was some type of oppression, right, somewhere. And even if I'm praying, to fight it off. And I still sometimes, even when I sleep, I feel like I'm getting attacked spiritually. Mm -hmm. Were you Were you watching? Were you watching in the years back? Were you watching pornography ever? Yes. So that, that's an open door right there. Well, that will bring those things yeah. in. Yeah. And then I review those, and then I stop watching. Those yeah. Things. You can you can stop that years ago, and still need deliverance from that from years ago. Right. They could be hiding right. from the past. So let's do this. So so let's start by praising the Lord. So Lord, praise God, yeah. yes, we Lord. praise you, Reggie, and my wife Ahav and I, and I. We praise your holy praise name, you, Lord. Lord. You are worthy. We give you all the praise, glory, and honor. You're the only one that we need, Lord. You're our everything, Lord. You're our healer, our deliverer, our provider. Yes. And we Lord. thank you, Lord, for ministering to Reggie now. And, and so right now, right now, you all go back into place right now in Jesus' name. You all go into place. Holy Spirit coming power. Go into place. All trauma go right now in Jesus' name. Be healed. Now move your jaw around. Still not. Still doing that a lot. Okay. All right. So say this. Say Lord, I thank you that you have forgiven me of watching pornography. Lord, I thank you for forgiving me for watching pornography. So you, all right, so right now, you spirit of pornography and perversion, get out of Reggie now. Get out, get out. Spirit of pornography and perversion, get out of Reggie right now in Jesus' name. His sins are forgiven. And all, all distractions be gone. Like this train coming by right now, it's like the loud distractions in your life. So we, we, can't, we cancel all distractions. And we're going to do supernatural weight loss since that's coming by. So, so all excess fat cells that melt off right now, leave Reggie's body right now in Jesus' name. Excess fat cells burn off of his body. By this earthly realm, so we just clear that right now. Every unclean spirit get off of Reggie's body. Your sins are forgiven. So all excess fat cells be gone. Every unclean spirit get out. Infirmity get out. And jaw be put in place. Jaw be put right back in place right now. Trauma go. And jaw come into place right now in Jesus' name. Be healed right now. The Holy Spirit move in power right now. We rebuke you, Satan, in all of your wicked attacks on Reggie. You can't have him. The Holy Spirit, move in power and reveal anything. Anything that needs to be revealed, reveal it, Holy Spirit, in Jesus' name. Jesus' name. It's, it's, it's more looser than what it used to be. You're being honest. It's yeah, more yeah, looser. Because yeah, yeah. I, I just felt the power of God. But not, not doing it. It's not doing it now. So, Lord, we thank you for Reggie. We thank you, Lord, for Reggie, for healing him. Yes. Every unclean spirit, get out completely and don't yes. ever return. Yes. Reggie belongs to Jesus Christ. You are the healed of the Lord. Yes. So, Joel, go back into place. Your mouth is blessed. You're going to be speaking forth the gospel truth. Yes. We cancel all corruption. Any, any corrupted words that have come out of your mouth, we cancel them right now. Your sins are forgiven. And, you, and you're, you've got the word of God in you. I can tell you've renewed your mind. And so the word's going to come out of your mouth. So you'll be completely healed. Trauma go completely. Be restored and be put back in place in Jesus' name. I, can, I feel Jesus fire name. now. I feel something going on over here. I feel fire now. More of that Holy Spirit. More fire, fire, fire. And excess fat cells burn off in Jesus' name. Yes. Excess fat cells burn off in Jesus' and name. And also the enemy tried to interrupt you. There are many times where the Lord gave you wisdom yes. and discernment to speak. But the enemy interrupted you. So
so that you couldn't release a word. Is that right? That's true. That's yes. very true. So we declare, yes. we, I curse that interruption and I declare full yes. alignment in right. Jesus' name. Jesus. Amen. Amen. It's better? Not doing it. Not doing it for the first time in years. Yeah, it's 20 years. It's yes, alive. it's been that long. Does it feel in place? Yes, it feels aligned. It doesn't feel. Yeah. Like... Praise the Lord! First Praise time in 20 years. <laughs> yeah. What's going on over here? Praise God. <laughs> Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Supernatural yes. weight loss. Yes. Yeah, tell me, did, did, did your pants fell loose? Tell me if your pants fell loose. I felt something go down right here. Yeah, like like I a, felt something move in. Move in. Yeah, right. Did, and, uh, did it get looser here? Yes, it went down a little bit. Yeah, so more of that, more, 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 yeah, more. more Supernatural weight loss in Jesus' name right now. Supernatural weight loss. Excess fat cells burn up right now. Your body is the temple, temple of the Holy, Holy Spirit. Spirit. Yeah. I just felt the power of God as I was saying. Yes, that. Your body really is the temple of the Holy Spirit. You are lean and ready right. to yes. battle yes. in the That's spirit. right. You are a mighty yes. man of God ready to kick the devil's butt. Everything. So more life, more life, more life. Yes. And that joy, you stay in place. Yes. You will stay in place. Yes. You're a liar, devil. Reggie, his sins are forgiven. Your sins are forgiven. Your name Jesus. is written in the Lamb's Book of Life. You belong to Jesus. That's right. Awesome. Amen. <laughs> Nothing. It's healed. It's healed. Yes. No pain. Yes. No pain. No 20 pain. years. <laughs> that. That's awesome. That is. That is awesome. That is so, I'm happy about that. I'm happy also about you, got, you know, praying for me to get healed and this issue with my stomach for years and then yeah. my throat and all this other stuff. You're going to lose weight now regularly over and the and next and month. And I hope I stop snoring too because, you know, that sleep apnea thing is... It's connected to it's the weight. It's connected to the weight. Yeah, yeah. so right. And, and so any unclean spirit also with sleep apnea... Yeah. Get out completely in Jesus' name. Jesus the name. Lord watches over you when you sleep. The devil has no entry point. We declare all those doors cut, closed in Jesus' name, and every Amen. curse broken. Yes. Jesus became a curse for you. Every curse broken in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 I saw that you would be plucking wisdom, wisdom and uh, direction from heaven. Yes. And um, and the Lord is telling me to speak over you. No more striving. So when it seems to be a roadblock, instead, you're going to pluck that wisdom and that instruction wow. from the Spirit, wow. and you're going to go around the road. I receive that. I receive that in Jesus' name. I receive Amen. that. Yes. Amen. I'm excited. I'm excited. So yes. In fact, Reggie you look. Reggie watches the videos. Reggie looks pastoral. Yeah, he does. I get, you know, I get that a lot. <laughs> when I start talking to my friends and family and people, yeah. About yeah. the Bible and the Word of God and yeah. how it's alive and true, they're like, you need to go into ministry. You need to do this. You need to do that. It's not like it used to look. God is changing the way the church looks. Marvel Watch Church is an example of that. Absolutely. It doesn't have to look the way it traditionally looks. In fact, I was telling a brother in the world earlier that uh, that when, regardless of political views, when, when if God puts a businessman in the highest office in the land. That means it's it's prophetic in the sense that he's raising up entrepreneurial Christians. Yes. And so that's for you, brother. Yeah. So like you, it's like the entrepreneurial spirit on you yeah. and in you, yeah. and also yeah. leadership and pastoral. And for, for you to do ministry the way the Holy Spirit has molded you to do it. And Not it's the way it's custom made. That's right. That's custom, right. So it's custom made, made. For you. I like that. It's, I'm like, yeah. it is custom made. That's yeah. why we do this. And that's why I love it. That's why I came down here today specifically to see you guys. Praise the Lord. You know, also early on I was hearing for you, the Holy Spirit was telling me about you. I kept hearing faith to receive, faith to receive. You have the faith to receive. Yeah. And yeah. He's going to give you a lot more just because of the fact that He looks for those with faith to receive. And Reggie didn't even know we were here. He watches the videos. Yeah. And he saw this. He saw that in our videos, the sun comes from this direction, <laughs> from the east. Yeah. So he figured out the time. He figured it out. So he's morning. Good morning. Yeah. And that's faith. Yeah, that's faith. <laughs> I, but I made right. a decision to do it the other day. And I was like, I gotta go see them. I gotta sit there. And I was like, if I go, I'm going to go around one or two. And I was like, no, it's too late. Let's time. I, I don't think they're there. The sun is up. Right. The east. I saw them from around nine, ten o'clock. I see if they're here. And you guys, sure enough, was right here. That's and amazing. Come one time a week. What? Yeah. Only so once a so week. You got the right day, even. The right day and the right time. <laughs> I'm the right time. And your jaw's healed. And my jaw's healed. For the first time in 20 years. 
is God is good. And yeah, there's no yeah. pain there. There's no pain. Ah, look, nothing, no foot, <laughs> nothing. I'm happy. It's like that guy in yeah. Charlotte, that jaw got healed. Yeah, that is so good. You have a lot of character, brother. Amen. <laughs> you go with it. You go, Amen. Go with it, God bless you both. God bless you guys. Yeah. 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 Hallelujah. So awesome. That's so Hallelujah. awesome. Yeah.